right, so we're back in Blackpool again. Hello. Hi guys. And as we saw before, I was on my scooter getting some money. We're actually in Blackpool now, so the moment to come where we go get the pass for 2018. So I think it's the third vlog of the year because the other vlogs we've done this year were Zip World and the Liverpool Ice Festival. So that is this is our third vlog of the year. Cannot believe it's the third one so far. We're gonna have so many vlogs out this year, hopefully. And Defo at Merlin Parks if we're going to get a pass. So we're guaranteed to get the towers. Hopefully Thorpe and Jensen as well. Because those are good ones. Legoland is definite though. We've already agreed we're not going back to Legoland this year. Because of how terrible it was last year. And what I'm saying last year, I mean summer 2017 to 2018 now. There's a tower, we did a vlog up there. Just before Christmas, didn't we? Yeah. Remember that, we did. Oh, you've got the money for the pass. I've got the money for the pass, yeah. Alright then, so we're off then to Blackpool. Well, we're in Blackpool now, sorry. We just need to get the Merlin annual pass. And then I suppose that's another year of fun guaranteed. Alright, so we got the Merlin pass now. And thanks to the staff in there because the old ones did not expire till around 19th of February so they, they made it so this one doesn't expire till the 20th of February 2019 so we got like over a year of it so that's pretty good So anyway, we're going to try and go down to Blackpool Pleasure Beach so we can have a look at the Wild Mouse um, uh, Before anyone starts, I'm probably going to go up to buy where Noah's Ark is to see it so anyone who's watching <clears throat> Scott from Pleasure Beach Experience Please don't have a go with me, I'm just having a look at the wild map. I'm pretty sure the staff would be okay with that. So anyway, we're not going in the car park now. So anyway, let's just wait. Oh no, I've left the pass on the tram. You're joking, aren't you? Of course, I'm joking. You would never do that, because <laughs> you're not that clumsy, because I wouldn't leave you that. I'd be pretty angry then, because we just spent 100 and you would, because we just spent 180 quid. Anyway, I hear talk that the just I hear talk there's going to be a new coaster on South Pier, so I'm just having a look around to see what I can see of this new coaster. So I hear talk there's a Reverend Shop Wild Mouse coming. Just going to go up here. There's like an open gate, so it should be okay. Yeah, I hear talk about a new coaster. And I'm just going to see if there's any track on the property, is it now? Because the Road of Sean Wild Mouse has taken only a few days to go up, so that'll probably come around February or early March. Probably just so that'll be a new credit for me, unless it's a relocated one I've already done. So I've heard talk about that, so okay, time look, then we're going to go see and pay respects to the Wild Mouse, a wooden Wild Mouse that just recently has been announced to be permanently closed. Are you sure we're meant to be around here? Because, no idea. Because the gate was open though, so we might we might just be asked to get out. Plus there's no there's an open door there, so it'd be okay I suppose, yeah. So I believe we should be around here. But if we're if we're not meant to be here, you know, that's their own fault because even doors and gates open. Yeah. Also I get hate on YouTube for this because I am filming. Yeah. So. If anybody's watching this and we're not meant to be here, we didn't realise the gates were open, so that's why we walked in. It looks open to the public. Well, I don't think it is there. I don't think it is there, so so far we did not see anything about the new coaster, but there is talk of a Red Shop Wild Mouse coming back here. There was one quite a long time ago from 1998 to 2009, I believe. And. I suppose we're going to see the return of that. Hopefully. Or maybe not the exact not one. Not that one, but the new one. It could be. It could be the exact one, but it might. It might. It might not be. It might just be another. Might just be another version. It might. Just, I don't know. I just want to try and stay away from if there's any music playing in there because. In the interest of health and safety, we're unable to hit the following to stop here: dogs, cycling, roller skates, roller blades, scooters, and skateboards. Why are they alone? How come they aren't alone? Scooters, I'm offended because I'm a scooter rider. Drive scooters for life. 
so I'm quite offended to be honest, I'm not really, I'm just joking, but still. There's the log flume, I'm pretty sure summer 2017 I came and rode this and did an on ride. It's all closed now, which you can see why I mean. Would you ride a log flume at this time of year? No. I would, but it just depends if I got soaked, I wouldn't enjoy it. I would probably, but... I think it'd be a bit cold. Which as well, would you ride Valhalla? In the middle of January, you will not, just a bit, towards the beginning of January. Hey look, there's an s and Frog Hopper by Logan, Utah, USA, so that's where s and is based. The s and what else have they done? They've done Ice Wash, which is perfectly visible over there. You can see Wild Mouse there. Is it me or can I see more of Icon? I don't know. But we're not going to do an Icon construction update because of some controversy that happened last time we tried. Because last time we tried, some people had to go at me for going on the car park. But I'm just going to go up by the entrance to see what I can see of the Wild Mouse. So I'm just going to see if all these rumours are true, which I'm pretty sure they are. I just want to see for myself about if Wild Mouse is really gone. Because I might have just been a photoshop and that statement might not may have been a fraud, but probably wasn't. It's probably it's probably all legit and it's probably just all gone now. And if it is, it's so so sad because I did a video saying it's gonna be closed, you know, forever really. So we're just gonna go have a look there, try to see the Not too sure exactly what we're going to do now. We did actually get to see the wild mouse though. We did see it and I will put, I'll probably put the picture I took on the vid. I'll actually take the... I'll actually, I took a picture right. I will put that on the video and it's my own picture. So I'll put the other picture that's similar. It's not yours, it's mine. So anyway, I don't know what we're going to do. We're probably going to do some of that. We're probably going to do like tower and that. We won't vlog a lot of it probably, but probably do some of the Merlins, you know, use off, use our new one for the first time. Yeah, yeah. yeah exactly, we'll use that for the first ever time. There's the log flume again and the SNS frog hopper. So we're just gonna get the tram and go back down to where the Merlin. So we've got a little bit of a change of plan. I'm still planning on doing the Merlins for a little bit later. I'm gonna, I'm gonna head to McDonald's now, the big one on the because it's, I'm pretty hungry to be honest so just head down to McDonald's so this vlog isn't really just picking up a Merlin pass because we've already done that this vlog is basically just going around Blackpool doing what we can do didn't film too much about the Wild Mouse I just got the picture which I will show I'll probably I'll probably just leave it on Twitter or something so maybe a few days later when this vlog's out you may have already seen it because I might just actually leave it on Twitter so yeah Maybe, yes. And there's a tram coming, so basically we could have just, you know, got ran over. Thank God we didn't. Not exactly miles, quite close. So, just head down to the McDonald's there to get myself some food, because this McDonald's is pretty cool. I actually edited this one back in, oh, I'm going to say October 2015, when the illuminations were on. I can remember eating at that one. It was a pretty cool one, so I'm actually going to go back there, so it's a cool McDonald's. So I may film a little bit, but I'm not too sure, but still, I think the main priority here is get Okay, so we're back off to where the tower is, might do the tower now, with our new Merlin passes. Um, just had the McDonald's, it was absolutely delicious, then went up by the beach over there to get a new self picture for hashtag new profile pic for my Instagram and my Twitter. Although the it's not me Twitter one just yet, as of when this is being filmed, it's now me Instagram one, so go check that out. I'll probably just leave it in the vlog, I probably won't still anyway. Now before we... <laughs> Before we do indeed end this clip and go to tower, I want to give a shout out to Happy Hurricane because this guy made me do it. I want to give a shout yeah. back to my Happy Hurricane. Okay. And I want to say please don't end your channel. Please don't, Happy YouTuber. Hurricane. Yeah, Happy Hurricane, you're an amazing YouTuber. Please do not delete your channel because it would be so sad. So anyway, we're off to the tower. Time for Daredevil Dad to experience his worst nightmare. Not the nightmare. 
Bloxy, no, not the nightmare, Bloxy Tower. Yeah, they're my nightmare. Yeah, your nightmare, your worst nightmare is Blackpool Tower, so we just keep getting across it, you know, and cross the road in a minute, and we can have Dead Double Dark experience's worst nightmare. <laughs> so, yeah, it's going to be pretty funny when we go back up to the top, and Ooh, it's going to be scary. Yeah, it'd be pretty funny to be honest. GP Dad's worst nightmare is happening. He's up on Blackpool Tower. I'm not gonna put I'm actually not gonna put my camera over the net last this not gonna put my camera over this time because what happens he just gets really scared, so I'm not gonna do that. But anyway, we're on wait, it's not the it's not the really no, big no, top. It's not even the top top yet. <laughs> I'm trying to get you over your fear. <laughs> anyway, up to the top. We're not quite at the top yet, but we're getting there. Oh, no, 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 higher. 412 feet. Oh. <laughs> oh. We're now taking you to extreme heights. So here we are, we're at the top. And it is pretty much a shame that this bit is closed. No. It is. It's a shame that it's a bit open. <laughs> oh. Why are you roasting Merlin now with that? Of attractions, this the Blackpool Tower. You're, here's the best thing to do, right? Now you can't see anything. Just pretend you're at the bottom. Yeah. Do that. Just pretend you're at the bottom, right? Yeah. Okay, so I think I'm getting down on the sphere, and he, he wants to live. The, he wants to do the extreme dream. By knowing he's at 412 feet tall, I believe. Wish it was higher, but this thing's closed for safety reasons. Oh. It's closed. I suppose you wouldn't even go up there. Imagine having to do to a drop tower like you start here. You can have like the loading station about here, right? And you can have it go all the way down. That would be amazing. But so that's one drop tower he'd never do. I do I just have a look over. So it goes all the way down. Great views, extreme thrill. Bang bang, Merlin. If you do decide to want a paycheck in the mail, a thank you letter for the amazing idea of building a drop tower here at Blackpool Tower that goes all the way down. Now that would be the best drop tower ever. Possibly my new favourite flat ride. So samurai, Merlin, do this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, yes. Yeah, we're going down now. <laughs> So we're actually going down now because Dad's too scared.
the clues are there in Blackpool, we got the Merlin Pass, we've been up the tower, which you can't really see too well, but yeah, plus I went to see the Wild Bows and tried to see if I could find the new coast at uh, the South Pier, I did not find it, so anyway, the vlog isn't actually over yet, because we're going to go home and unpack the, unbox the privilege pack, so this is like an unboxing video as well, but at the very end, so it's like a remix top 10 anyway, crossovers not really, but still anyway. So we're just gonna get home and unpack the privilege, unbox the privilege pack. Okay, so we're back home from Blackpool. So I'm gonna unbox the privilege pack now and see what amazing things are in it. So without further ado, let's open this privilege pack, Merlin privilege pack, and see what I've got this year to come with my 2018 annual pass. Now I'm not too sure how to open one of these because it's been nearly a year since because I've got it was done in February the 2017 pass. I just got it for my birthday, my 13th birthday to be exact. Yeah that's last year so nearly 14 oh my god. Not too sure how to open one of these because it's so it may take me a couple minutes. Hopefully it won't actually do that but so anyway, it might not even be the size, I might just need to do this. So you'll just have to bear with me a couple minutes, guys. Not a couple minutes, couple minutes, guys. While I get this sorted out. That sort of out just opened. Hopefully 2019, when I renew it again, the privilege pack will be easier to open. And I've just opened it, so we got... My year of magical memories start here, and my must-dos, I must, my must-dos is that I must test my ninja skills on Lego Ninjago the Ride at Legoland Windsor Resort or Miniland. Hell no, I will not, because Legoland is a joke. I will not do that. Um, choose your side at Wars of the Roses live show at Warwick Castle, maybe. Ride the new Tiger Rock at Chesney World of Adventures, I really want to. Um, ignite my senses on a brand new world class experience coming 2018 at Alton Towers Resort, I will be sure to do that. Experience the Year of the Walking Dead only at Thorpe Park Resort, yes. Spot London landmarks on the Coca Cola London Eye, unlikely I will, but who knows, maybe I will. Meet Shrek, Donkey and their DreamWorks pals at Shrek's Adventure London. Again, maybe. Take a thrill-filled thrill -filled journey through Britain's murky past at the dungeons. Probably not, because I'm not a fan of the dungeons, really. Take a selfie at Madame Tussauds. Learn all about caring for seals at Sea Life Sanctuaries. And walk on air 380 feet above the ground at Blackpool Tower. I Skyfall, I've already done that today, so that's one of them that's been ticked off, I could tick that off if I wanted, visit Sharks at Sea Life, probably not, and follow at Merlin Annual Pass on Facebook or enter the competition to keep up to date with the, with the latest news and offers at our attractions, so yeah, that, that might be something I might want to do, so let's have a look, so that's not, so that's all, it's uh, time to open the privilege pack and i've got myself a lovely new lanyard to go with my lovely new merlin pass which is right here guys and i got the selfie but i'm not going to share it because i'm not going to share the back of my merlin pass for security reasons so i've got the nice new merlin lanyard here so that's so that'll go well so merlin entertainment thank you so much for that let's see what else we got So with that as well comes with that comes a five pound fast track offer for Alton Towers, a five pound fast track offer for Thorpe Park, and a five pound fast track offer for Chessington. Or oh, voucher, sorry, not offer. Share the fun, bring a friend for only fifteen pounds. I think that's like again Towers, Thorpe Park, and Chessington. So that's pretty good. So. Also, I've got a new pop badge, Merlin Annual Pass, which is pretty good. So, I will put that there with all of these. With, well, not all of these, because there's only one other thing. 
except for the flash, excluding the flash track. So we have a nice new Merlin lanyard, a nice new pop badge that says Merlin Annual Pass, and these vouchers. We have a five pound flash track offer for Alton Tower, so I'm, I might just use it. Same with Thorpe Park and Chesterton if I go. Share the fun, I will probably do that, but mind you, I don't have many friends, so no, I won't be able to do that, to be honest. So, who knows? Who knows? Maybe I might make some friends 2013. I'm joking, by the way, so anyway. That is pretty much it for this vlog and unboxing video. I really hope you did enjoy. Welcome, premium hustled. I'll read that off. I'll read that off camera, but anyway. Thank you for watching this vlog and unboxing video. I really hope you enjoyed. Feel free to like and comment below. Tell me what you thought of the vlog. Tell me if you have a Merlin Premium Pass or if you've recently renewed it. Thank you for watching this vlog and I will see you on the next one. Goodbye guys.